I'm Jennifer Morris from Howdini.com. Have you heard about face yoga? The idea is that with facial stretches and exercises, you can keep the muscles in your face firm and younger looking. Annalise Hagen, a yoga expert and the author of The Yoga Face, is here to demonstrate some moves she says will keep your cheeks from drooping. Okay, Annalise, what can we do? All you need to do is tone the muscles in the cheek area. So you have a few, you have rhizorius, mm -hmm. and you have zygomaticus, and you have the buccinators. And where are those? Those are? The buccinators are like where the apples of the cheek would be. And rhizorius and zygomaticus, zygomaticus sort of is under the zygomatic arch. So they're both along the cheekbone area. So um, let's start with the satchmo, just because it's fun and you're working the buccinator muscles. So what you do is you take an inhale of breath and you puff the cheek um, you puff the breath from cheek to cheek. So I'll demonstrate. So I called it the satchmo because of Louis Armstrong. And if you notice people who play the horn, mm -hmm. they tend to have very firm cheeks because they're work working those muscles. And how many times do you have to do it on both sides? Until you run out of breath. What are some others? Well, I like this one a lot. It's really uh, for the nasal labial fold, you know, the droopy marionette line, which is part of the cheek area. So in order to help, and believe it or not, I used to have really big sags here. So this one's been very effective for me. And you can think like your Bugs Bunny, because you're isolating exactly those muscles right there. They're the levator labii muscles. They lift the lips. And that's for those lines right here. Yeah. And then you just put your fingers into the indentation, the crease, so that you have resistance. Try not to move the eyebrows. Try smiling. Yeah, that helps to be a little more relaxed. You want to isolate so your nose and brow isn't moving. Give it some good pressure right in the crease. You actually don't have much of a crease there, but it's like right here. It's a very subtle movement. It's just here. You'll feel a pulse. And how long do you do this for? Uh, 20 of these in a row and then like three reps of those. So we've done the Sachimo, which mm -hmm. is back and forth. Mm -hmm. And then we've done this one, which I need to work on. Right, the marionette. We've established. And then yeah. what else can we do? Well, we can also do the prom queen, which is stretching the corners of the mouth towards the ears with a slightly upward smile and like you're laughing out loud. And it's good to widen the eyes here because that'll work your eyes at the same time and it'll prevent muscle creases happening. And just feel that stretch of the lips towards the ears. Yeah. And open the mouth. Ah. And the more glassy eyed and crazy you look, the better? Oh, absolutely. Okay. Yeah. We don't like to use, you know, the term crazy. Oh, right. Just <laughs> committed. <laughs> and how long do you hold that for? Uh, Five to ten seconds, and you should be able to feel some stretching happening here. Do you? I do. You really stretch those corners. I feel corner. it back here. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm feeling the burn. Ah, me too. All right, is that the whole series? Yeah. Okay, and so if I do that, it will Absolutely. sculpt the cheeks. Sculpts and lifts. Um, there's one other one you can do, which is I, I call it the smiling fish face. Now, this one is a little odd, so bear with me. Not that the other ones have not been. <laughs> but um, you're going to make a fish face and smile simultaneously. <laughs> I'm sorry. I told you. I know. <laughs> it feels a little odd, but I'll try it. It's going to help but my cheeks. The hard part is not the puckering, but the lifting up at the same time, right? That's what's really toning the cheeks here. If you say so, I will give it a try. Thank you so much. Okay. <laughs> I'm Jennifer Morris for Howdini.com.